Hey you guys, I am Russ from Team Callahan. And I'm Shanae. That's right. And uh, welcome to What's Up Wednesday. Uh, we are continuing our discussion about interest rates and buying power. And uh, something we've noticed over the last two weeks is that what have been historic, not historically high, but reasonably high interest rates are going where? Down. That is right. They've been going down for the last two weeks. So that means if a buyer, uh, which most buyers do, have a fixed monthly payment number in mind, um, they, uh, the low interest rates is helping them buy more house. Um, and then, uh, you know, consequently, if you have a fixed price in mind, then a lower interest rate will uh, lower your monthly payment. So that might um, you know, open up your budget for other kinds of expenses. So anyways, we're gonna tell uh, that story using two examples of homes that uh, have either sold or are under contract here in Savannah, and we're gonna see um, how interest rates help. So, go. So, the first house we're gonna be looking at, this house here in Parkside, which closed at 400,000. So, about a month ago, when interest rates were you know, 6.125, um, with eighty percent down, you'd be looking at a monthly payment of $1,945 a month. And now, currently, with our interest rates hovering around 4.75 with 80% with 80% down, mm, you'd be- 20% down. Yeah, 20% <laughs> down, you'd be looking at about $1,669 a mm. month. That is a whopping savings of $276 a month. Sweet. Yes. <laughs> Take it away, um, Russ. So, so basically by buying the same house or the same priced home uh, at two different interest rates, uh, we just showed that you can save $276 a month. Mm -hmm. um, so uh, that's, how, that's how a lower interest rate can open up more in your budget. You can, you know, that's half a car payment essentially. Um, but what if, what if you, your flexibility isn't in um, monthly payment? What if it's like, hey, I'm cool with a $2,000 a month payment. I'll just buy as much house as I can, right? So a lower interest rate can help you buy more house. We take a look at this house right here compared to the house we just looked at. Uh, this house is 250 square feet larger, okay? So it literally is more house, okay? And it's... Uh, $50,000 more expensive, right? So, you know, if someone's buying this house instead of at 6.125, like it would have been a month ago, at 4.75 now, with the same amount down, they're looking at a monthly payment of, uh, I guess it depends, 1953 or 1956. So they're keeping roughly the same payment, it's $10 more, but uh, buying a lot more house. So they might have a larger family or need an extra room for something, a little office, and they can keep that same payment and buy a bigger house. So the moral of the story is uh, interest rates are going down. They've been going down for a couple of weeks. Uh, if you've been sitting on the fence, now is the time to get off mm -hmm. uh, because prices will continue to go up. So if interest rates go down and prices go up, your buying power will remain flat, but only for this time. So um, you'll get it. And holler if you have questions. Bye. Bye. <laughs>